Imagine creating the perfect child, strong, healthy, and brilliant. Today some believe it's possible. The tool? Polygenic embryo testing. But what price do we pay for perfection? For years, PGT helped families avoid genetic disorders. It's precise, it's preventative. But now we've taken a step further into the realm of probability, personality, and potential. PS analyzes multiple genes to predict disease risk, and possibly traits like height, weight, and intelligence. Not just avoiding illness, but choosing advantage. Startups now promise to rank your embryos by intelligence. Some charge up to $50,000, and wealthy parents are signing up, even when they don't need IVF. IQ prediction is based on polygenic risk scores using genome-wide data. But here's the reality. PRS explains only 2 to 11% of IQ differences. That's maybe a 2.5 point gain, barely noticeable. A child's future isn't written in code. Education, love, trauma, and opportunity matter just as much, often more, than DNA. Genes aren't single-purpose tools. One gene can affect many traits. Raise IQ, raise autism risk, boost cognition, trigger anxiety. Just because we can, doesn't mean we should. Selecting embryos for advantage feels eerily close to eugenics. Selective breeding cloaked in high-tech. Tech titans push for a smarter human species. Genetic companies promise IQ optimization. Scientists warn, slow down, this isn't a toy, it's the future of humanity. Designer genetics could deepen inequality. Will only the wealthy be able to upgrade their children? What happens to everyone else? This isn't just a family decision, it's geopolitical. Countries are already racing to build a smarter future. Will others be forced to follow just to keep up? Marketing exaggerates certainty. IQ prediction isn't destiny, it's statistical noise. Parents chasing an ideal may end up disappointed or worse, devastated. What about the child? Will they feel pressure to live up to a profile? What happens if they fall short of their genetic promise? We've tried this before. The belief in better genes led to forced sterilizations, racial purity laws, and genocide. Technology has changed, the temptation remains. Science has given us tools once thought impossible, but with power comes responsibility. Is polygenic testing a miracle of prevention or a step too far? Like share. Comment below, would you screen for IQ, or should we leave some mysteries untouched?